Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Pikmin 2. We're finally heading to the Wistful Wild one last time for that final cave in the lower left corner. It's the final dungeon of the game. Let's go ahead and wrap this bad boy up. On day 25, not bad. I don't know what like a good amount of time is, but I feel like 25 days, you know, pretty reasonable. It's a lot of caves in that amount of time. We've got a little bit of work to do first. Um, probably going to go ahead and just have one of my captains, in this case, Olimar, take the purples. The perp. And we need to clear a bit of the way. So there are some dangers along the path that we still need to fix before we can safely embark on the final area. Be nice if I could hit this snitch bug. Get him! Okay. Look, make sure all your Pikmin stay off the side. You don't want them to fall down. Uh, these are nectar eggs, obviously. Sometimes you get a potion out of it. Let's see what we get. Any luck? No, of course not. That's okay. Okay. So this area right here is a little frustrating because... We have our typical enemies here, the uh, Fire Blowhog. Last time we'll ever see one. Dead. But in here, you can see it kind of stomping around a little bit. Where'd it go? Oh, it's down there. So first thing first. Did not eat my purples, that'd be great. Being a little reckless here, it doesn't really matter at this point. Last dungeon, do whatever you want. Um, ooh, that's not good. I have uh, like 50 or so purples. Oh my gosh, come on. 50 or so purples that are kind of expendable at this point. Trying to be careful not to accidentally trigger the cutscene. But one last time, the Gatling Groink. Probably one of the more annoying enemies. Very strong too. And when I first played this, I thought that that explosion would cause it to kill you. So that did concern me a little bit. Anyway, make sure you carry back the corpse. Carry the corpse. We have a puffy blowhawk here, which is annoying, but you know, it's not really a threat anymore. Go ahead and punch it. Punch its face. Should probably be a little more you know, respectful of my Pikmin, but, you know, at the end of the game, you do what you gotta do. These purples are very slowly carrying this back. Let's go ahead and grab these guys. Dispatch of the, uh, Puffy Blowhog, if I can get it in my range here. Here we good. Okay, dead. All right, back to the Objective at hand, very slowly carrying this, uh, <laughs> this Gatling Groink. I'm actually gonna have the captain go ahead and do, how many do we have? 21? Alright. So we're gonna need to grab nine more purples. You're gonna want a pretty even spread of Pikmin, so just keep that in mind. I usually go 30 purple. I say usually, I've never done this dungeon before, I'm being dumb. Um... And that gives us, I believe, 20 for most everything else. I normally go 15. There I go again. I said it makes sense to do 15 yellows because there aren't really, like, too many electric traps around. And usually if there are electric traps, there's, like, Bulbman. One thing to be mindful of, though, in this final area is um, there are no candy pot buds. So... What you get is what you get. Just don't lose your Pikmin, I guess. We're racing against the clock. So that Groink does not res revive itself. How close is it to coming back? Oh, it's getting close. Have to fight it again. Alright, purples, get him! No, oh, you butthole. What an annoying enemy. 
All that for that. All right, well, guys, you're supposed to eat the nectar. Come on, or drink it, or whatever you gotta do. I gotta go get one more purple. Ugh. Annoying. Should've just had the whites go and carry it back, but you know what? Who cares? It's the end of the game. Anything goes. At this point, I probably could just scoot past it. It's really not that big of a deal or a threat to me anymore. You're no threat to me, Groink! Okay, let's get the Pikmin. Okay, got my full team of a hundo. There's the captain. Got a little bit more nectar up here. Let's go ahead and grab this because stupid puffy blowhog deflowered on my perps. Come on, get it. Hello, hello, hello. Everybody. There's a delicious nectar down here. Oh my gosh, are you stuck down there? You idiots. Oh, you big dumb buttholes. Come on. You guys be better be on your best behavior. I'm gonna eliminate you from future games. Oh wait. It makes me wonder if they're ever gonna bring them back. I feel like there was a bonus mode, maybe, where you could use purples and, and whites, but I don't quite know. But anyway, we're gonna rumble on past here and enjoy yourselves, your final cutscene viewers. Here it is. Ooh. Bop, boop, boop. Perhaps you'll find Louie in here, and yet my CPU is on edge. Ludicrous. Dangers await. Yes, so this is the final, most difficult cave in the game. Surprisingly, though, not the longest cave in the game. That is the Cavern of Chaos. Or the Hill... <laughs> no. The Hole of Heroes. I literally just did Hole of Heroes. And I misappropriated it. Are we missing some? Wait, 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 wait. What's going on? How am I missing a Pikmin? Did something get stuck? Hold on a second. What in the good gosh dang is happening? I could have sworn I had a hundred. I had a hundred when I walked across the bridge. Okay. Well, what color am I missing? That'll at least inform me. We're missing a perp? How? Oh, viewers. This is... Oh, you're stuck up against the wall, you big dummy. Get over here. Run so you don't get moited. I am using so much time, which is unnecessary because this dungeon's so long. I should stop. All right. Get yourself some nectar, boy. All right, there we go. Viewers, the final dungeon awaits. Wakey, wakey. No time for dreaming, viewers. Okay. This is the final dungeon of the game, as I obviously said. First things first, we have a really obnoxious jelly float that we're going to try to aggro away from the poison spout. Also, these uh, dumb bull borbs. I'm going to kill this one. You're a dummy and I hate you. I hate you. That took way too many Pikmin to do that. Come on. Are you stuck over there? No! You big stupid, dumb, big dumb stupid. You can tell I feel viewers, feel very strongly about that one yellow Pikmin. I don't even know if I can get over there, can I? How did any of my Pikmin get over there? Like how do any, how does anything anywhere ever get over there? Well, you know what? You just get to hang out right there in purgatory, because you're dumb. Okay, so obviously there is a treasure in this dungeon somewhere. We're going to find it. And we're going to care. Ooh, there's a Cromad. Viewers. 
If you see that 100 dip down to 99, you'll know that that yellow got munched. Okay, so we got our purples here. Got the president. We're gonna lure out the Cromad. Okay, very good. We just need to be careful here. Um, we don't have the ability to heal, obviously, like I mentioned before. So no healies, no candy pop boots. Oh, it's way back here. All right, well, you know what? Operation kill everything! Yes! Okay, so that's obviously necessary. Gonna kill the jelly float. We're gonna need our uh, white Pikmin here. This is one of those times where you do, you need your, your helpers. There's a lot of poison spouts. You gotta be careful you don't dip your Pikmin into that. And our Pikmin, I, in the past, they've been taking really strange routes to get to where they need to be, especially with delivering treasures. So I'm just going to preemptively knock these out. It's just, it's just so tough to know where to put your Pikmin sometimes because the game will just arbitrarily decide that it wants to murder your Pikmin. Okay. I think that 15 Pikmin should be good. So obviously we're going to go ahead and take down the Poison Spout. That uncovers the exit rock. We're in between a rock and a hard place. We'll use the purples for this. Although, the whites are like, we're gonna do it ourselves! Alright, that's fine, whatever. Um, I wanna stay away from that side, because that's dangerous! We'll split up. I mean, I could've sworn that I... I could've sworn that I... Ooh, no, 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 no. Nope, stop. Stop, quit. Guys, it's the one It's the one last gig. Can you please just cooperate? I don't ask for much. We're only on the first floor. All right. So I believe that this item is exactly 15. Yes. I am amazing. All right. So they should be able to quickly, the fastest possible. I don't know if that's actually helping. <laughs> But the moment they get it back, we can move on to floor number two. Pretty painless so far. I'm trying to do these quickly because I know that this cave is 14 floors long. And I ain't got no time for that. Okay. A fruit. What do you think you are? Pikmin 3? Ooh. The disguised delicacy. It's funny because Kiwi looks like poop on the outside. Poop. All right, here we go. Moving on. Okay, viewers, we have survived a floor. Can you believe it? Okay, first things first. Let's get two captains going. One of the most annoying enemies in the game and the most annoying fig configuration is here. So it's the Gatling Groink. Go ahead and position Olimar there. Because as far as I know, this should be a safe spot where the Groink can't hit him. So instead, yeah, his health isn't going down, so, so far so good. Grab your perps. The perps. And as long as he's distracted, we can clear out his buddies. So that's very good. You're going to want to do this before you actually engage the Groink. The Pikmin have a tendency to fall off the area where it is, and they will die, so... Just trust me on this one. You don't have to do it this way. It's just convenient. And I'm trying to be safe playing through this way because of the, um... The lack of recovery anything. There's no recovery floors or candy pops or anything like that. Purple is like holding on for dear life. He's like, this is my bull borb and you'll never take it from me. Okay. Let's go ahead and deposit the purples to a safe distance. I do not need white Pikmin. 
The only downside of this growing part is that you do actually have to use the, uh, the yellows. I don't know if I can go around the outside and hit it and quit it. I'm actually gonna toss my yellows up there and see if this is safe. See if it'll shoot the cannon onto this spot. I don't think so. Toss my yellows up there. This is really annoying. Um, go ahead and lose half of them already. Guys, what was the point of that if you're not going to stay where I told you to? Stay on the block. Your lives depend on it, and so does mine. Okay. Go ahead and do that. Have my yellows attack it. Probably doing basically no damage. <laughs> that's not like, that sounded like a burp. It was like, Bleh. I wonder if I can just do this safely. No, Captain Olimar, what have you done? Run, yellows, run! Oh no, I've aggroed everything. Oh, the plan is the plan has been spoiled. Okay, regroup. <laughs> That's not what I was trying to do. I forgot there was another bull borb still alive over here. I heard it and it caused me to panic a little bit. Bop, bop, rope a dope, Captain Olimar, give him the rope a dope. Yeah, I can't really be having my uh my captains take too much damages. Cause we were on floor two out of 14 and I got a lot of work to do. Makes me wonder if I could even get purples up there. I don't know. They're obviously gonna be the ones that are gonna do all the damages. And he's just repeatedly blasting that one spot which is pointless for him. Can I even get purples in there? can't tell if it's... Is they're doing anything? I think they are. Looks like damages are being done. Are you kidding me? How much HP do you have? Okay, there is... There is an item in there. I see it under him. Okay, whew. All right. <laughs> Let's get some reinforcements going on. There we go. We're so close to finishing this shenaniganery. Shenaniganery. Wow, I can't even say one of my catchphrases. This Let's Play is off the rails. It's okay, viewers. Just relax, okay? Relax. The Manual Honer. Okay, so far so good. You feeling good, viewers? I'm feeling pretty good. Okay, that's... Oh, look at that! Nintendo 64! The Implement of Toil. Were there Nintendo 64 branded pencils? I almost said crayon. I'm not a crayon. Alright, let's get the heck out of here before that Gatling Grunt comes back to life. So far, so good. No deaths. Okay. Whew. Floor number three. Halfway through today's episode. Ooh, this looks like all kinds of horrible. Um, well, viewers, this is another one of those obnoxious floors where you're potentially going to accidentally toss your Pikmin into the abyss. We'll go ahead and keep it 100 here and get rid of this electrical trap. No idea if this is going to be a value to us, but this is something I'd recommend. Got a little tip about this one. So this is one of those floors where the game likes to drop bomb rocks on you. I'm actually going to also get all of them ready with the purple squad just in case. There's probably going to be garbage waiting around here for us. And I want to be ready. Go ahead and clear out these poison traps. I have a feeling there's going to be bomb rocks and stuff popping out. Let's go ahead and... There's one. Yes. That's what I thought. Not today, game. Not today. Okay. 
We can kill this bull boar if we land on it. There we go. You just gotta be patient. Be patient. It's good for you. Okay, there's another one too. You think you're so cool, game. Well, you can use your white Pikmin. Oh, you don't eat my Pikmin, you goober. Come on. This is what I get for only bringing three. And now I only have two. Come on, gentlemen. Ladies, whatever you are. I'm confused. Is this is this a buried treasure? What? It's pinging hard. Or this way? Oh! It's a spotty bull bear! And a bomb rock. Ooh. Ooh, come to this! Come to this! Boop! Got- Ooh. That is violent. Okay, yeah, you gotta get- you gotta really land it on it. Here we go. Alright, we gotta be careful here. Where's that spotty bull bear? There he is! Get him! Okay, whew. Nice try, game. Ha, you thought! The Glee Spinner! And that looks like a thumbstick for a, for a GameCube controller. Not what I thought it was at first, though. Yeah, you know what, you can carry it back. Remember, the Spotty Bull Bear is one of those two enemies that does have the ability to reincarnate, which is dumb. Alright, where is the exit? Is it covered in rocks? No, it is not. We're gonna escape! Unscathed. Hopefully those Pikmin, uh, <laughs> weren't dying in the process. <laughs> okay, level four. Halfway through today's episode. Oh my gosh, this is gross! All kinds of cannon beetles. This looks like a job for... Purples? Okay, well... I think that's probably the only way through here, to be honest. Pur purple squad. We got a... They're so triggered! I wonder if I just like hide right around the corner. That'll be enough to do it, because it can't hurt me from here. Why is that already being hurt? Oh, it's anode beetles. <laughs> They're just blowing each other up. Can I convince them to do that long term? Is that a viable option? They just kill each other. Let's do it. Yeah, just blast them, man. Blap. Oh, is it only available when they're open? Oops. That was actually really bad. This is too much for my small brain. <laughs> I'm gonna need two captains and I'm gonna mess this up by getting my uh, my actual Presidente killed here. Alright, can you hurt me from here? Sort of. Alright. Anyway. Alright, let's wait for it. And go! Move in! Okay. I'm not super afraid of the anode beetles, to be honest. It's definitely the... Cannon larva. No, 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 no. Whoa. Alright, you guys hang out here for a second. I need yellows. Man, this floor sucks. I mean, all these floors kind of suck near the end, but... This one especially is a little bit... Nasty. Okay, yellows. My, it's like my my special squad of electricians. All right, so they're hiding around the corner. It's very convenient. Come on, get them. 
pretty sure it's not going to be able to actually attack me here because of its location. And, nope. And this Anno Beetle is essentially rendered useless. Null and void. All right, I cannot see. <laughs> Game. Okay, move in. Attack! My, my special operations purple squad here. Okay, and just to be safe, because I don't trust this. Man, this camera angle is divine. I almost said delicious. It's delicious. This camera angle is delicious. Please kill it. Oh my gosh. The yellow Pikmin are so weak. Make sure you don't throw your Pikmin over the edge. I said pickles. I am struggling with words, viewers. What else is new? Thank you. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We'll keep the yellows around because there are more anode beetles in proximity. We'll wait for it to fire its dumb, dumb rock. Come on. Okay, move in. Being very surgical. Oh, no. No, I lost a purple. I thought I got out of the way. And Tommy did not. Okay, now where's the... Oh, I gotta use... Ugh. Oh, you're coming in, boy. He's coming in hot. He's like, remember me? Whoa. Nope. I don't think so. I'm probably gonna regret using that there, but that's... Where in the good gosh dang is all the treasures? No president. No, 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 no. We don't have time for that. Can I call you off? You didn't know. Just hang tight. Just hang tight. He's like, they're being good little workers. Oh man, there is just so much before you get to the exit. How many treasures are there? Ugh. The moment I get whatever the treasure is, I am skipping the heck out of this. If I can. Oh, that one white Pikmin is not flowered. He's so slow. Oh, yeah, we're not even close. There's the poison pipe that's up this way. Sneak it around town. Yeah, I'm just trying to be very surgical here, viewers. As you can see. Very messy. Well, they can definitely blast you over the over the boundaries here, which is not cool. Rock, rock back! No! Oh, you big dummy! We might have to do the distract attack method. Ooh. Yeah, that's... Oh, man, I don't like this at all. Oh, they killed the... Oh, you know what? I could have used the... Oh, that's a pain in the buns. I could have used the uh, poison spout. Have that explode via rock. Anyway, I'm killing this guy in a second. Okay. Just die already! Okay. So that's good. I mean, my trusty yellow squadron. That guy down there is ignorable. We got anode beetles here. Just want to see if I can convince the larva beetle to. No, stop it. Guys, enough. Are you still trying? Quit. Don't you heckin' dare. I wanna see if I can convince it to... Oh, the traitor's way down here. Can I convince you to kill these guys? Shoot them! Give them the blast, us. Oh my gosh. You guys are just... Unrelenting. Oh, wow. Yeah, this floor is horrible. Oh my goodness. I've got a feeling this treasure is gonna be... Light? It looks light? It's just, can we get it without getting electromecuted? Oh, oh, he's going in hot. Actually, this is good. He's aggroing us here now. Come on, hang tight. 
No! Yellows, run! Oh, that is so uncool that they can do that. This is, yeah, this is a, this is a little tough, tough little bit. And I don't think we have a real, we don't have an effective method, except for maybe being able to aggro the anodes up the hill here. We're shooting up that hill. We're trying to kill them with our yellows. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where do you think you're going, boy? Dude, stop it. I don't have many of you. Stop. You're being dumb. All right, watch out. We gotta try again. You only really need to get the one, you know? Did they make it all the way back with it? Please kill this. Once you kill the one anode beetle, then you're good, but... Be a tall order, apparently. All right. So we've eliminated one part of the circuit here. Oh boy, these floors are taking me forever. It's the final cave, viewers, leave me alone. Okay, I'm gonna try to... Oh, I just wanna kill that cannon beetle so bad. I'm like nervous, I don't wanna lose my squad here. I'm trying to be very surgical. I'm still afraid that I'm gonna accidentally toss my Pikmin over the edge and kill him. Oh, I hate this thing so much. Yeah, there's no, there's no good way to do this. Come on, yellows, get them! And that stupid cannon larva it doesn't count. I think I might actually have it in a spot where it can't kill me, though. Yeah, I keep shooting over the edge. All right, just one more. Just one more, viewers. Oh, I do not like this. I think I'm just gonna try to sneak past them. Yeah, no, 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 no. Stay away, stay away. Stop, 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 nope, stop. Ooh. Stay away, stop, quit. No, stop, quit. Purple, stop. Oh my gosh, no, please don't. Stop it, quit. Ooh. All right, let's have you go back. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Reconvene, reconvene. <laughs> oh, that was close. Okay. I gotta stop losing purples though. I'm gonna want them for the final showdown. I'm like losing the Pikmin that are super valuable to me. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? Quit, you big dummy. Oh my gosh, you are so dumb. All right, let's kill. Let's kill this last anode beetle. Just gonna try to hammer away. Get him, please. Oh, yellows, come on. One more. One more whack at it. Okay, okay, so as far as I know, like I said before, anode beetles without their life partner are useless, I think. Okay, ooh, so one more cannon larva there is. Okay, we're gonna hide back. Okay, we got one more cannon beetle left. I'm gonna go and moiter it. I'm not afraid of the anodes because it doesn't seem like these two are in sync. Are we stunned? We stunned? Oh, we stunned the anode beetle too. Ooh. Okay. I don't think that there's any synchronization going on here. So we should be able to just carry this obnoxious treasure. 510. All right, I'm actually gonna follow this one back because I don't trust it. Wait, no, you big, oh, you big dummies. Mm. 
I gotta borrow a purple. Hello? Anyone? This one, hello. Oh, I hate that. That's so stupid. All right, just go. Hurry, quickly. Away from them. You idiots. Okay, you guys can hang out. Oh, did I have another? I had another white. I could have used all... Whatever. Whatever. Just speedy quick, please. Ugh. Yeah, okay, you're slowing it down. You got a long way to go. Hurry. Oh my gosh, this recording is going to be Gigantosaurus. Boing. It's kind of a nice touch, though, when you bonk into it. All right, guys, today. Oh, this is annoying. The mirrored element. Is that the end, please? Okay. Ooh. Let's get the heck out of here, please. Okay, viewers. Prepare yourselves for more chaos. There's a lot of fiery crap going on. So we're gonna sneak around the outside and avoid it entirely. Okay. I'm gonna try to lure this fiery blow hog my way. Get rid of this fire trap. Nope, that's no, 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 you dummy. Glad doesn't kill those Pikmin. I like how I try to organize by reds and the game's like, hey, how about a yellow? This game is so dumb sometimes. All right. So, anything can be used on the fire blow hog, obviously. Just whistle your Pikmin if they run into danger. Okay. Now, just a heads up though. Um, you can only use red Pikmin for fiery bullblaxes, which is what it appears the treasure is inside of. Anything else that you throw at it will be incinerated. How did I get an extra? Oh, I was going to say, wait a second. So, here's the tried and true method. I like to use the bitter spray, of course. Until it's all good and murdered. Okay. Spits out a, uh, a nectar as well, it appears, so. I don't understand the pathing. Because that's, hold on. Uh, game, why can't you just do things the, the easy way? Because, D-Mike, that would be fun, and we hate fun. Okay. The game is being personified as a wimp. Gotta kill this guy first. There we go. Now, now you can carry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop it, you dummies. I didn't say do anything with it. <laughs> the AI in this game is so stupid. Oh my goodness. It makes me look smart. You can carry it over fire traps, dummies. You are fire retardant. Okay. Just please be done. I don't know how much more of this I can handle. Just gonna wait it out. Okay. I think this is the only treasure of this floor. Okay. Alright, let's get the heck out of here, viewers. This is crazy!
Oh, viewers, 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 viewers. Okay. So this looks like crazy chaos. I'm going to hide all my, all my Jimmy Jams back here in this alcove of safety. All right. All right, no floor or no ceiling goodies. I said floor. All right, where is the treasure? Man, this this soundtrack is very farty. <laughs> All right, we got cannon larva. Please kill each other. I'm gonna need y'all to fire. Ooh yeah, this is good. Fire away. How did I not hit it? Oh, they heal themselves after a while. Come on. Oops. <laughs> yeah, blast him. Oh, so farty. Really need some high-end attacks coming my way here. A little help. This jelly float is trying to suck me so good. Oops. <laughs> I gotta be careful. I'm gonna need the captain at some point. I'm not gonna have him when I keep getting crushed like this. Is it the jelly float or is it the... I honestly can't tell. No! Stop! He's sucking me! Stop it! He's sucking me! Oh nice, the cannon lover stopped me from getting sucked. He's an ally. All right, come on, shoot. Shoot me. Shoot me, suck me. Can and larva. That's a new song. From D Mike Records. Called Don't Try This at Home. Oh man. I got the bing bongs of the present. That's annoying. Viewers, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. Okay, I think it is the jelly float. Oh, man. Okay. I think that worked. And now I can kill you! Okay, that actually worked out pretty well. Minus the... Uh, ever-present... Here's the exit. Let's get Olimara with... Whoever's left... At this point, I don't even care. Whoever's left, just carry that treasure for me. Oh, look at this. Just a little too heavy. Oh, is it a little too heavy for you, Pikmin? See if there's any, like, nectar or potions hiding behind these walls. That's not bad. I only need a ton of nectar, so just a little bit would probably be good. Uh, and the treasure is secured. Very good. Ooh, the future orb. Orb. All right, viewers, one more floor. Hang in there. Here we go. Today's finale. Right off the bat, a withering blowhog. Oh my gosh. That's incredibly annoying. But you did put it in reach of all my best Pikmin, so. And this is the one that doesn't, um, it doesn't defly your Pikmin, thankfully. Is that the treasure? Oh my gosh. What great RNG is this? Oh yeah. That's amazing. I think this is the only treasure on the floor. The essence of desire. Oh, wonderful. Oh, that's amazing RNG. Now, the only thing I need to figure out how to do is to find the exit. And I've got a feeling the exit's probably going to have those, like a dumb cap on it. Oh, hang in there, right, you big babies. All right, so I got 10 white Pikmin. 
And we're gonna go on a speed mission here. First off, where's the exit? Yeah, it's just such a farty soundtrack. Oh, it's all the way in the corner. He's dumb dirigiba. Oh, get away from me. Let me go. President already is. He's already endured enough. Oh my gosh. Apologies for the loud click clack of my control stick. I just need Olimar to run through here. Bomb rocks exploded. Just run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. No, no. Distraction. Distract. Please, wife picker, please. President. Olimar. Just have Olimar run around in a circle while they try to uncap that exit. Oh, this is chaos. Hurry! It's like trying to buy enough time. I'm hacking the mainframe! Buy me some time! I'll take your sweet time, White Pikmin. Jeez! Oh, that dumb withering blowhog. He's interrupting. I'm trying to... <laughs> I'm trying to slow it down. Get off of me! Alright. Get out of here! Go! Run! Hurry! Viewers, that's it! We did it! Oh, viewers, okay. I'll just leave it off on this, on this stage, because I'm too nervous. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Pikmin 2. I'll see you next time for the final episode. Bye.